Hey everybody, it's Mama Jan. We are back with part seven. That's right, part seven of our comic books. Now remember, one through six does have a giveaway attached. A new giveaway will start with video seven. We'll go through so many and then we'll do a giveaway again. So right now we're going to go through the pile that we have here of approximately about 15 comics and decide what we're keeping and what we're letting go. Now, as you know, I'm trying to really focus on just keeping some Wonder Woman and the rock and roll comics. That's basically what I'm trying to focus on right now. I really need to limit the collection. I'm one of those people where I decide I want something and I go full force and then I change my mind and I have a bunch of stuff I don't want anymore. <laughs> so we're gonna go through these. Oh, it looks like, oh, we got quite a few here that look like they might be keepers in this pile. We got the rock and roll Metallica. So that's pretty cool. As you can see, they're wearing different shirts, too. That's pretty awesome. Um, you know, their faces could be a little better in the drawing, but as all in all, not too bad. Uh, nothing as bad as that Bon Jovi comic I showed off a few episodes ago. Woo-wee, yeah, right? Then we got The Fall of the New Kids. This is part of the rock and roll set. I believe the New Kids have a couple comics in this set. I might have shown one off already. But there is the new kids on the block. Ooh, and this one is really cool. We got Aerosmith. We all know how sexy Mr. Steven Tyler is. So that's a pretty awesome one right there. Judgment of the Damned. This is pretty cool. Wonder Woman comic. This will be a keeper too. So that's pretty awesome. Oh, look at there. Another rock and roll comic, and we have Mr. Rod Stewart. If you think I'm sexy. Genuine R&B. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I never really thought of Rod Stewart as R&B, but if you say so. We got Wonder Woman. I might have a few of these. I believe this is the comic that comes in the, like, the $5 comic set you buy at, like, Target or Walmart or whatever, I think. That's a pretty awesome, or however much they are. They're probably not $5, I'm just guessing. This one is really cool. This is a Harley Quinn comic, and it is a virgin cover. So that's pretty awesome. Okay, I just noticed I have another one here. So I have two of them. One is the virgin cover. They're both variant covers. So these are pretty cool, but I have two different variants for this cover. One has no writing on it, which is the virgin cover, and then we have the one with the writing on it. So those are pretty cool. They're not going to be keepers, though. I'm not going to keep any Harley. The Punisher Warzone, not keeping this. Things like this probably came in mystery boxes at some point. This one is Toy Boy. Hey, quit. I'm a good guy. I have no clue what this is. Jason Curter Toy Boy. Doesn't sound like it's rated anything but X. Oh, now this is a really sick cover. I believe this is another one that Teresa Newell sent me. And this is a pretty awesome cover. And this is one of the Dark Knight covers. And it's Aquaman playing the keyboards. I love these covers. Those are one of the few covers I am keeping. Here is another one. Another death metal playing the drums. This is pretty awesome. Love these covers. They are so friggin' cool. Here we have DC 100, Justice League America. Uh, probably not keeping this. I'm not sure. Probably a mystery box or something I got it in. Because I don't think I would have picked this up. Let's see. The next one we have is another one of the thick comic books and this is batman detective comic pretty cool pretty cool cover but probably not a keeper it is a thicker book as you can tell 1027 it's pretty awesome but not a keeper for me last but not least we got another batman the next batman future state also featuring outsiders and arkham knights it's actually a pretty cool cover that will not be a keeper for me Pretty cool. I mean, I'm really digging these Dark Knight covers. I'm hoping to get the whole set of that too, so I kind of want to see where I'm at with that also. But as for the Batman and the Iron Man and all that other stuff, I'm going to have to let it go so that I just kind of weed out the collection. So 
So again, if you've seen anything you like in the I'm not keeping pile, let me know. We can work something out. Other than that, eventually they'll go up for sale or giveaways or something so that I can go ahead and remove them from the collection. But let me know what you think, which one you like the best down below. And again, do you collect comics? You know, do you, did you even know? I've had a lot of people tell me they were clueless to the fact that there were so many music comics. And I just showed off a ton more from Rod Stewart to Metallica to Aerosmith. So let me know what you think and what band do you hope there could be? You know, unless you go look, then you would know. But what band do you hope there's a cover for? Or what band do you hope I have a cover for? How about that, that we haven't showed off yet? All right. And don't forget, leave that comment because that will get you entered in a giveaway. And stick around. Check out my Patreon. Say get something every month. If you're interested, there is a link down below. And until then, we will see you in the next one. Keep on rocking.